welcome to bad news. With our host, Sarah Enriquez. And our guest, Alex Husek. Welcome to Bad News. I'm your host, Sarah, and I'm here with Alex. So, Alex, um, how are you doing today? Horribly. Horribly? That's fitting, because we're talking about bad news. Um, what did you do this morning? I woke up at 8 and had to drive here, which is a hellhole, because it takes 15 minutes, and I have to wake up at 6.30 and go to bed at 10.30. Waking up at 6.30 <laughs> is hard. Like, I used to be an early morning person, but now, like, it's just hard for me to wake up because I stay up so late. <laughs> and sometimes, and I have to also get a 1254 bus. Oh, you take the bus to school or? Driving home. Okay, the bus driving home. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, I live in Ventura, so it takes me around 40 minutes to get to school. So it is like waking up early. And with like my other sister working and my other one um, going to school as well, we're like, I'm going in the bathroom at this time. So it's like Sometimes <laughs> when I'm here, I feel mm -hmm. like I'm a server at enslavement camp. Enslavement <laughs> camp? Why do you feel that way? <laughs> because uh, um, I sometimes have to do tough jobs. Especially in this class. It's definitely <laughs> different than like the other film classes because it's uh, like live television. Yeah. Well, enough talking about bad news for now. We're going to go to commercial and we'll be back right after this break. Have you a loved one ever been diagnosed with cancer? Hopefully not, because treatment could be expensive. But if you said yes, I may have a s solution. Introducing the miracle drink, Cancer Rib. It tastes like blue Gatorade, but with the added benefit of curing cancer. With one payment of $13, you could get this life-changing drink. Cancer Aid, available at Walmart. Welcome back to Bad News. I'm your host, Sarah, and I'm still with here, Alex. Um, Alex, so on the topic of bad news, um, what else do you want to share with us? Well, me and my parents were planning a trip to Egypt. Mm -hmm. We were going to the Nile and all that, but to Israel and Gaza. Oh, wow. Yeah. We can't do that. It's kind of hard. And I'm kind of mad because they're rebooting a Scream franchise because the mm -hmm. Melissa Burra. I heard about that. The Gaza. So she was supporting yeah. one of the sides, and they didn't like that, and like decided to have her off the Yeah, the and movie. that's why we can't, mm -hmm. we might not be able to go. And what about her co-star? Um, Jenna Ortega? Yeah. I think she's good in Wednesday, too. But she ended up dropping as well, right? Yeah, because movie? of her. Oh, okay. And then Nev Campbell, who plays Cindy, wants to be paid $75 billion. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I'm like <laughs> actors ask a lot. Yeah. Um, what other bad news? We were mentioning earlier something about the holidays and how you weren't too much I of a fan. I don't like it because there it took one year. It took 18 people mm -hmm. at our house, and my cousins just played video games, watch movies, while I slept in my parents' bedroom. Oh, those iPad kids. They're yes. always on there their phones and doing before games. Uh, um, and this was before iPhone. But usually uh, holidays can be like an enjoyable time because you get to enjoy like food or see family. Are you not really yeah, a fan of that? Yeah, one of the cousins that? I like. Okay, that's good. It's just the boys. Yeah, they're a lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they eat and then come back. Eat, well, come back. that's all the time we have for today. But it was good talking to you, Alex. Um, I'm your host, Sarah, and this was Bad News. Thanks for watching. <laughs>